A year and nine drafts later, county commissioners in Lubbock have approved a game room ordinance with a few key amendments. The vote was three to two with County Judge Curtis Parrish and Precinct 3 Commissioner Gilbert Flores voting not to pass it. KCBD News Channel 11's Dylan Villa tells us what is in the ordinance and how its supporters intend for it to limit game room activity. After January 1st, Lubbock County will only be issuing one permit to allow a legal game room to operate within the county, just one. Those are the words of Judge Parrish following the passing of Lubbock County's game room ordinance Monday morning. Commissioner Jason Corley originally proposed limiting game room permits to one for every 30,000 residents in Lubbock County. Judge Parrish argued, since game rooms can only operate in unincorporated territory, it should only count residents within that area. That population comes out to just over 34,000. With the approval of Judge Parrish's amendment, the county will only permit one game room starting in January. My goal through all this was to make sure that we, we got to a place where we're going to make it hard for these folks to operate in Lubbock County. I did not want to see any game rooms at all, but the law says that we have to have some sort of an ordinance. So that's what we passed today. Commissioner Corley says this further restriction to only one game room could turn into a legal battle down the line. I am a little bit concerned with some of the changes that were made. You know, I mean, I specifically went and worked with a trial attorney. I was like, all right, so, you know, you pass an ordinance. What's that first thing that happens? Somebody sues you. Okay, well, let me go ask the guys that do the suing. Hey, what, what do we need to do? How do, how do I write an ordinance that's, uh, that's defendable? I mean, what, what could you, you know, let's start throwing stones at this thing before it even passes. And, you know, we worked out uh, any, any which way uh, we could think of to make sure that uh, it would be defensible. Each of Lubbock's game rooms, now more than 80 of them, will have to apply for that one permit by January. As part of another amendment, it will be located in Corley's Precinct 2, southeast Lubbock County. It is my hope that they will see these ordinances, hard to abide by them, and, and want to go out of business, move on down the road, go off somewhere else. The new measure also requires that single game room to stay a thousand feet from any residential neighborhood, house of worship, and playground. The ordinance also limits hours of operation, requires background checks for owners and employees, and forces proper security on site. Dylan Villa, KCBD News Channel 11.